Hello, and thank you for joining me. We're going to talk about how to bag and freeze breast milk. For starters, I want to recommend that you always use breast milk bags that are designed for storing breast milk. Don't use Ziploc bags or sandwich bags or any containers that are not intended for storing breast milk. So you want to make sure that you're using proper sanitary containers and that they're going to properly store the breast milk, especially freeze the breast milk. Uh, this is the type of bag that I'm going to be using today. These are, I think it's pronounced Lansano breast milk storage bags. These are one of the newer upgraded versions where these ones you can actually pump directly into the bags instead of pumping into a bottle and then into the bag. So you can always just pump directly into the bags and then move on to the next step of getting the air out of the bag, sealing it, and then freezing it. But in the event that you want to, let's say, pre-measure before you pour in the bags, then you can do this step first. So these are the bags will come in these types of individual bags. There's like three bags like this in this bag, a uh, box of 100, pre-sterilized bags. And then inside you'll find one of the bags. Most all breast milk bags are similar. They're about the same um, style. They have the bag with the labeling, whether it's on the front of the bag or up here. You're always going to find that they're perforated edges at the top to, to peel this off. And that's just to keep the bags inside sterile and then the place name date. So you would just go ahead and, well first you would fill out the bag here, the date, the volume, so like if you had four ounces or five ounces, how many ounces of milk you have in there, the name and time. And after you fill that out, you would pour the milk in. Now this here is five ounces of milk. And I do recommend to first wash your hands before handling the breast milk. My hands have been washed. So then you would just pour the milk into the bag. And once you have the milk in the bag, you're going to want to get the air out of the bag. Kind of lay it flat. milk spread so you can kind of get it down and it just pushes the air out and you can go ahead and seal the bag and kind of I seal a little all except for this little edge over here just to get the last bit of air out and then it has no air in it at this point there's two zip um, seals on here make sure you have them completely sealed so that no air is getting in no air is getting or excuse me, no air is getting in no milk is getting out once it's completely sealed, it won't leak. And then you'll just take this and you'll put it in the freezer. You're going to lay it flat like this. And you can even tuck this top part under like that when you freeze it. What we're going to do now is go ahead and put it in the put the breast milk bag in the freezer and you just lay it flat down here. I have, this is brown packing paper. You, know, you can use a cookie chute or you can use a brown paper bag or something just to kind of keep it sterile. And this is actually almond milk. It's not breast milk because I'm going to be using this to thaw for the next presentation on how to thaw and serve breast milk. So we're just going to go ahead and get let that freeze. And thank you for watching.